740 is your time now. Well, it is the fastest highway in the nation, and its caretakers are going to space to take care of it. I had a chance to speak with the team overseeing SH 130. Dad, can you tell us about this uh, new technology that you and your team are using on SH 130 that measures ground movement on the road? The soil here in Texas is, is what's referred to as heavy soil. It has a high clay content. And so the soil tends to expand and contract and that can affect the roadways. Satellites fly over the location of the road about twice a month and they take images. And what we're able to do is to take those images and identify certain points on the roadway. We have 30,000 of them and we measure how much those points move every time the satellite flies over. We want to monitor that so that we get a head start on any maintenance that needs to be done in connection with that movement. Uh, can you tell us why this is the best choice for SH-130? It's very cost effective um, and it is a vendor that we're comfortable with. And by using this, one of the things we're able to do is detect very, very small two to three millimeter movements uh, in the road services and we can do that on a more or less continuous basis. That is a movement level that visual inspection would never pick up. And so we can be much, much earlier. Explain to us how this helps drivers. The roadway that we have is wide open, um, highly predictable, and also very fast. Um, and one of the reasons why it's fast is because it's not congested. Also because we have the highest speed limit uh, in the United States at 85 miles an hour. And so making sure that that road stays smooth and safe and comfortable is something that will, will help riders. The other thing that it allows us to do is by identifying potential problems earlier, engaging in what's referred to as predictive maintenance rather than reactive maintenance, um, we're able to do very small repairs so that we can avoid the sort of lane closures that go with more major repairs.